What's up guys, Mr. True Vapes here, back at a new video. If you haven't checked out my previous video regarding me travelling to Rochester to film at the Vaporizzo store, um, we did a little cloud competition between myself and Steve, also known as Fallen Coils. My coil architect who makes all my coils, be sure to check it out guys, the links will be down in the description below. Alright, so starting off with this video, you see something new. Yes, my background is completely changed, right? It's because I got my vape cabinet now, it has finally arrived. Um, got my juices over here for me to do reviews on got my mods which I play around with and all that um, I'll do a little detailed in this video regarding my um, vape cabinet anyway guys in this video we've got the vape cabinet we also have the coil master vape mat so this will make my videos a lot better when I do my little close ups and everything and we also have the Coil Master 521 tab to do the unboxing on both of these bad boys. And yeah, let's go check it out, guys. Alright, guys, first up, we're going to open up the Coil Master vape mat. So I picked this up on eBay. Shout out to Jolly Vapor for hooking me up. They sent me a Just Vape It band as well. Sweet. Uh, price point is £13.99, free delivery. Sweet! This is going to make my videos a lot better when I do my up close and personals. So, yeah. So, originally, this is a large PC gaming mouse mat. Uh, you can also use it for building. It. Yeah. Size is around 85 centimeters by 40 centimeters. Look at that. It's beautiful, man. See on the back of this. A nice non-slip feel to it in the front. Is very nice. I like it. We're gonna have a quick look at this. Let's check it out. Very nice sized mat. And there we have it, guys. The Coil Master Vape Mat. Feels really nice, man. I like it. Makes my videos look a lot more professional now when I do my up close and personals. All right, moving on. We got the Coil Master 521 tab. This is a volt slash ohm meter with a built in fire button. So you can preheat your coils without using your batteries on your mod. Finally, an upgrade from this little device here. So this one, throw away. All right, so it's all sealed and everything. Beautiful. Let's open it up. I picked this up. For £25 on eBay. Sweet! Those deals right there, man. Alright, so it's got a nice box for it. Coil Master. 521 tab. Let's get this zoomed in properly. Focused. Alright, so it's got Coil Up to be Master. Coil Master there. 521 tab, same motto, sweet. All right, so this is the back of the box. All right, so it's a 521 tab. It's got ohm meter, voltage meter for, what's that? MEC, mod regulated, mod. Coil, rebuilding deck. It's got a coil burning, table mod, reverse battery protection, sweet. Specifications got resistant measurement range 0 0.01 to 9.99 ohm. It's got voltage measuring range 0 0.3 to 9.99 volts. Resistant rate as low to 2 0.2 ohms. Connection is a 510 threaded with spring loaded pin. Charging is a 4.5 volts 750 mAh micro USB charging input. Battery is a lithium 18650, 3.7 volts. Batteries are not included in this product. So you can either charge it with the USB or you can just stick in an 18650. Me, I have over eight batteries. So yeah, probably do the battery method. It's a nice picture of it. Coil, Ma Coil Master, scratch code, 
uh, coilmaster.net. Yeah, sweet. Let's open it up. All right, there we go. Let's get a little manual for it. Oh. The information contained in this document is important. Um, yeah, okay. Interesting. <laughs> Get a Coil Master card. Uh, Coil Master's doing a giveaway. Sweet. Here's the device itself. Beautiful. Looks nice, feels nice. Goes out five, two, one, tab. On the bottom we have some information on the actual device it's got the same resistant range and everything you need to know on it it's made in china by coil master authentic ding ding it's got your charging port right here so you just plug it into there if you can see it so on here you can see flick it this way we do a pre-fire middle is off and reading your meter so yeah Sweet. there you go so that's your 18650 if you want to use the 1860 for that nice magnetic back panel for magnetics on the box clicks in beautiful man over here you get another box This is your charging cable and all that. And this is a voltage checker. Ooh, so I can check the voltage drop and all that stuff. Definitely need to read a manual on this bit. Ooh, yeah, look at that. Beautiful. Alright, so I'm going to stick the 18650 inside. I'll put a coil on one of these RDAs and yeah we'll test out the ohm reader and we'll test out the pre-fire button all right guys so I've got my 18650 here this is a 3000 mAh battery by Samsung shout out to vape club for these battery condoms man they're amazing all right open it so it'll be negative on the bottom positive on the top there you go you should see some lights I'm using the Temple RDA. The coils in this build is Alien Claptons, which are 26 gauge times 3 plus 32 gauge, measuring at 0 0.2 ohms. Beautiful, man. Forgot to mention these Coil Master clippers are amazing. Oh, cut so perfect. For the coils, in this packaging shout out to John over at sub ohm vaping supplies they got Facebook and everything links will be down in the description below and he also supplied me with the temple RDA as well so yeah beautiful they'll be opening in a shop very soon be sure to check out the Facebook for notifications on the progress all right Turn it on to me. Oh, whoa, look at that. That looks sick. Screw it on 0 0.15 ohms. Four point one five volts. Blue light. All right, let's pre fire this bad boy. Telling you how many volts. See that? Oh. There we go. There we have it, guys. Both coils burning a tree. This device is so sick because it drains battery on the actual 
5T1 tab so you don't get your device hot as well sweet amazing device man be sure to pick up one of these all right guys last but not least the vape cabinet on the top we got a smock bag along with a vapor expo uk snapback that was from the vape expo both of those vaping outlaws bag was when i bought my kanga tech from the uk e6 store in wembley all right so let's open it up all right so first shelf we have the coil master with the 5 to one tab we just done a review on that bit We've got my sub-zero um, RDA there 24 millimeter hybrid along with my no this is amazing man got my authenticity card and everything nicely laid on top shelf because this miss mech mod here was my one year non-smoking cigarettes present so yeah stays in the shelf on top here we have a VCM stacked clone shout out to John over sub ohm vaping supplies for hooking me up with one of those we're doing a review on this man this bad boy is amazing this stack looks so sick feels so sick as well doing a review on that one very soon just waiting for my coils on those all right next shelf we've got the coil master these are the wire cutters those are amazing man got cotton bacon along with all these coils whatnot unicorn bottle got juices to do reviews on some i've done already so this is the zeus juice they sent me 25 bottles that's one of each 10 ml bottles of their whole juice range 25 bottles that's probably going to come out in a five part series yeah or five juices at a time it's a long one i want to give you guys the best detailed information on juices that's why next up we got cornish liquids i've done a review on their cornish liquids sweet classics and they sent me some more so this is the other range on it sweet over here we got cloudy heaven and they have supplied me with their sample pack which is 10 different types of juices to review on we'll be doing that soon that's dnb juices at the back uh, rhubarb custard another rhubarb custard i know um definitely need to rate them which is my favorite second and third um also we've got uh, cloudy heaven space mango i've done this juice on my node if you haven't checked out be sure to check it out guys that juice is amazing that's from malaysia i believe all right so reviews coming soon on these juices all right so next shelf we have my mods but the wismic rx 200s uh, we have the smock x cube 2 we've got the snow wolf 200 watts have you noticed they all have decal yes i do love my decals man over here i picked this up at the vape expo which is a koopa primus it's a 300 watt box mod yeah amazing got a yep e-cig this is the hell's gate v2 this one is amazing as well i've done a video on that also down below here we've got the pokeball custom mod along with a 24 uh 24 karat gold plated playing card box and now yeah really nice man this little bad boy here was a very popular guy at the vape expo for people mod like vaping this guy all these videos majority of them i've done reviews on still need to do a review on the snow wolf 200 watts as well um yeah over here is like my business cards and everything got my one this is city boy vapors done a review on their sub source also city boy vapors juice if you haven't checked it out check it out guys all these links will be down in the description below we've got john over at sub ohms vaping supplies and shout out to dean over at dnb juices for hooking me up with the um, rhubarb custard 
I've tried all the most of the flavors, but like red rockets and everything like that. So yeah. Alright uh, guys, last on the shelf is a Nick Vape. They have provided me with their sample pack. Um, yeah, it's got like camouflage. We've got cloud vapors. Yeah, we're doing a review on this one also. I believe these are like mix your own juices. So need to get into all of this sort of stuff. Vape bands, camouflage range. And yeah, there we have it, guys. My vape cabinet, my Coil Master build mat, and also my 521 tab. Videos will be getting a lot better, man. Thanks for watching, guys. Be sure to leave a thumbs up, comment, rate, and subscribe. For sneak peeks, be sure to check out my Instagram at Mr. Chew Vapes. And yeah, see you guys in the next video. Peace.